This is the Greek Word of the Day with James Gregory. Well, hello there. Welcome back for another Greek Word of the Day. Today's word is anthropos. Anthropos. Alpha, nin, uh, theta, rho, uh, omega, p, omicron, sigma. It means man. Well, not really. Mankind, it's often how it's translated. Really, it's about humankind. It's about a human, a person, people. There's a different word in Greek for man. There's a different word in Greek for woman. Anthropos historically has been translated man, probably due to patristic influences. Uh, the reality is it's, it's broader. Human. Human. So, anthropos. Say it with me. Anthropos. Anthropos. Now, the genitive is anthropu. And it is masculine for the sense of grammar. Okay? Uh, o would be the article. All right? So, anthropos. Anthropu. O anthropos. All right? And uh, what's cool is, let's see what... Uh, Trusty B Dag has to say about Anthropos here. Uh, this keyboard's different. There we go. Person of either sex with focus on participation in the human race, a human being. Uh, it can take E, the feminine article, but according to BDAG, it does not appear in our literature. Again, showing that it's not just about men, it's human. It's beyond just man. Um, it, it can apply to female as, as well. Um, member of the human race with focus on limitations and weaknesses, a human being, a male person, yes, uh, but uh, practically, functionally, um, someone, a person, uh, it's a, a being in conflict at a transcendent level, the outer being, the inner being. So, a uh, new being, a um, person who has just been mentioned in a narrative with the article, the person, a person perceived to be contemptible, a certain person, used in uh, address. So, when you're addressing a friend, um, and there's a familiar version of it, anthrope, friend. Um, and lastly, it's a human or a heavenly being that looked like a person, a human figure. So all of this is to say anthropos is uh, important but very wide-ranging. It occurs over 500 times. I forget the, the total amount, but it occurs a lot. So you're going to see this word, this noun, quite often, anthropos. So I hope you've learned a bit about this word. Enjoy. We'll see you uh, tomorrow for the next Greek word of the day. Bye-bye.